Alright guys, what's up? How's it going? Iron Man here. Today is February 9th, and in this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to get true, legit landscape texting for free, absolutely no trials, etc. And first off, I want to say, if you've noticed, I get this voicemail password pop-up. If you guys know how to get rid of that, because it gets really annoying, then please let me know in either a comment or PM. But let's get this video started. Um, you're going to have to have a jailbroken device. This does work on the new firmware, I believe, which is 2.2.1. And you do not have to add any sources, but I will be adding the sources in the annotation as well as in the description if you do not already have them installed, which they pretty much come pre-installed with Cydia. But if you're having any problems, I will list them in just in case for you guys. Um, I will have these pre-installed for the sake of the video because I did pre-record this again and it was too long, so but I will be showing you um, every step. So you're going to open up Cydia, excuse me, and let it load everything till you get the screen. Then you're going to go to the search tab and tap into the search bar, and you're going to type in Byte SMS. And again, I will have that in the annotation as well as in the description. And you will see it's the first one. It has a little pink icon. Or you may see two uh, green and purple bubbles. Uh, for texting. Then you're going to go in the corner and click install. Once that loads, you're going to click confirm and let it load. It's a very quick download, but again, for the sake of the video, I do have it pre-installed. And what this is, is landscape texting. Then you can pause the video right now and, and let it load. It will uh, ask you to restart and respring your springboard, which you will need to be doing could take a minute or so. Then once that's done, you're going to go into the Open Up Cydia again, tap into the search bar, and type in Byte SMS again. You will see your new pink icon load, as well as a new, well, not new, but under it you will see Byte SMS iReal. You're going to tap into that, and click Install, wait for the screen to load, and click Confirm. You do not need to respring after this, and uh, once you download this, it, if you do not have it installed, it will install Rename and Winterboard. Basically what this does is it changes the icon for By SMS and lets you rename it. So I'm going to close. And you will notice in the next free space you have Rename and By SMS. So you're going to tap into Winterboard. And close to the top, you'll see by SMS real icon. Tap that and click the home button. It will do a soft respring. Let it do its thing. Sorry if it seems like I'm rushing this video, but I've done it a few times, so I have to kind of cut down everything. Once it's done respringing, go to where you first left off and you will notice it has a new icon which is the green standard default SMS application and for the sake of the video I'm not going to do the renaming that's kind of self-explanatory tap it to the rename application and rename it text unless you don't unless you would like the by SMS then you're going to go into Cydia one more time guys I promise let it load its data and do its thing and load the screen. Again, there are no sources to need to be added. You should already have them, but in case that you don't, I will have them in the description. So click on more info and you can check out the stuff there. could take a minute or so. Everything's slow depending on your signal and whether you not you have a strong or weak Wi-Fi or Edge or 3G. And right now I'm in somebody's Wi-Fi so it's going to take longer. I'm just going to skip this part guys because my Wi-Fi, I don't know whose Wi-Fi that is. So then you're going to tap into the search bar and type in boss prefs. Oops. Sorry guys, it's all one word. Should be the second or first one. And 
and it will have the little light switch and tool icon. Tap into that, click install. Once it loads, click confirm. I believe it will ask you to do a soft respring and click the respring button. Once it's br brought you back to your lock screen, unlock it, and in your next place you will have this little switch and it says on, boss press. Tap into that and let it initialize services and load, kind of like uh, Cydia. Then in the bottom left you will see an icon that says poof and it, under it says hide icons. Click on that and let it load all of the new icons that you've just added. And what this does is hide any icon you desire. You don't have to, but this does help. You're going to go to the default applications pre-installed on your device and click on SMS text, turn it off, let it load, and click the home button and let it do its hard respring. may take a minute or so. And this will hide the default application SMS. And once that's done, it will bring you back to the screen and you will notice it's gone off my dock. Go into the by SMS and hold it, drag it to or wherever you would like. Then open it up and you will notice it looks exactly like the default application SMS. And this is just Daniel, 3D Viz 2009. We're just, this is just, um, we're probably bugging him at school or something, but we're going to ruin his life at school and so I can show you guys. You're going to tap on the blue arrow. This is not a trial. You do not have to pay for this. By default, it will send SMS messages via by SMS. I got a few messages on this saying, do I really have to buy credits, which is right here. You do buy credits if you want to send uh, via by SMS. What this is, is makes it cheaper to send text messages rather than if you have a unlocked iPhone and you don't want to spend that much money with uh, T-Mobile, etc. But if you do have AT&T and you're already paying for it, or you just don't even care, just click on Mobile Carrier. This is a lot easier, so just click on that, guys. Go to scroll down, Enable Landscape, and Enable Default SMS App. And down here, you'll notice how many messages were sent. You can reset that counter if you'd like. It's just an added feature. So once that's added, go back and type a message. And you will notice that it's lit up, send via carrier. You can send it, and obviously you know that I have sent it. I don't want to bug them too much. And if you want landscape, just slide, simply turn it to either side. And there you go, landscape texting. And you can see you can send it again. You may notice this little blue uh, circular counter in the left-hand corner. That's how many messages you're going to send. If you were to send, like, a book, <laughs> if you're writing paragraphs, and not only do you have landscape texting with this application, if you can tell from high quality or if you can just tell already, you can see you have emotions now. So whenever you do a smiley face, a wink, a sad face, etc., you will see the icon and so will the other person if they do have an iPhone or maybe it's just you. But either way, you have it. Not only that, but since you've enabled default application for SMS texting, the next time you get a text, you will enable quick reply. So if you're in an application, it's a, uh, excuse me, I'm talking kind of fast. Um, for example, Safari, and you don't want to close it, you can simply quick reply, and there you go, guys. That's your um, SMS texting landscape, as well as emotions and quick reply without paying and out without a trial. So there you go. Um, enjoy that. Kind of a fast tutorial, but I'm showing you guys how to do it. I will catch you guys in my next video. I have a few unboxings for you guys, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.